got some not so beautiful weather, unfortunately, on the way as we head through the weekend. We are going to see nicer weather than what we saw today, certainly doesn't take much really, but we will still be tracking a few showers here and there for your Saturday and Sunday and a big cool down on the way as well. Let's take a look outside. We'll take you out to our roof cam where we've got some low clouds and fog outside right now, but not a whole lot in the way of rain. Just a couple of scattered showers here and there through the overnight hours. You can see on storm scan three though. This storm is not done with us yet. We had the heavy rain push offshore early today. And now we're seeing still that influence of low pressure just sitting and spinning and it's really going to cut off and kind of impact our forecast through the next several days. We're going to be under the influence of this persistent low pressure, bringing the chance for showers. There are a few in central Pennsylvania right now. A couple of sprinkles trying to pop up here on the radar picture, but nothing all that impressive just yet. Certainly not like what we had today when we set daily rainfall records in Atlantic City, Wilmington and Trenton. All three of those spots with over an inch and a half of rain today, about 1.4 at the airport and just under an inch in Doylestown. It was a very wet start to our Friday. Temperatures right now still on the mild side. Despite that east wind, we're at 66 in Philadelphia. All that gulf moisture brought some warm air with it, but that's going to change as that low sits and spins overhead. We will eventually tap into some cooler Canadian air, and you'll feel that starting on Sunday. So more clouds than sun this weekend. Few showers tomorrow. Still can't rule out a sprinkle Sunday, but that's when the cooler air moves in and a gusty breeze both days this weekend. So we start tomorrow relatively dry. A couple of scattered sprinkles here and there in the morning. Best chance for showers comes through the afternoon, and you can see they're not everywhere. It's not downpours. It's not a washout, but just scattered showers around through your Saturday. Sunday starts off with some sunshine, and then could see a few instability sprinkles as that cold air starts to move in. Your Broad Street run forecast, well, it'll be a little chilly, mostly cloudy, 51 degrees at the start of the race at 8 a.m. on Sunday, but at least it's dry. We couldn't say that last year. And here's our cool pattern. Monday feeling more like March. The high only 56 degrees. Tuesday just 58. We should be around 71 this time of the year. So tonight's low is 58. We'll barely get to those numbers by early next week. You'll see a few breaks of sunshine on Sunday, especially, but scattered showers anytime through the weekend. We'll need to break out the coats early next week, and then it's just a slow climb back up the ladder mm. to some seasonable temperatures. Hopefully, this means once we get to Memorial Day weekend, we'll be talking nice, warm summer weather. I just got a chill here in Utah. Yeah, 56.